Hi, it's Eva Gitsopoulos from Remax. I've got a quick market update for you. The latest figures are in for the month of March 2020, and this is how things stand overall. Sales um, are up uh, over last year, 12.3% from 7132 last year to just over 8,000 this year. Listings, still a strong market. Listings are down 31.5% from 15,500 last year to 10,600 this year. Prices are up. They're up by 14.5% from 788 last year to 902 this year. Now, having said that, that is the average for the month. However, in the month of March, it's de definitely a tale of two very different markets. The first two weeks of March, the pre-COVID-19 um, market, the sales and price increases were incredible. We were up in the first two weeks, 49% over last year. And in the second two weeks of uh, March, the post COVID-19 market, uh, the sales have gone from increasing by 49% to dropping by 16% over last year. So just a huge, huge drop in sales. Now, prices overall for the month of March were 902. However, during the second two weeks of March, the average price was 862. Now, while that is a uh, pricing that's quite a bit down from the first two weeks of March, it is still up 10.5% over the same period of time last year. Now, with so much uncertainty, uh, clients and friends are asking me how real estate will be impacted. Definitely, there's no easy answers in these unprecedented times. However, everyone's situation is unique. And if you would like to discuss further, I invite you to give me a call for a chat. You can reach me on my personal cell anytime at 416-568-2702. Now, real estate is considered a, an essential service. So we are still operating. Um, I'm taking all the precautions necessary and doing contactless remote uh, services as much as possible. So I've got the vi thorough videos and walkthroughs of all the properties. I also do virtual showings, uh, contact less, contract signing and negotiation, uh, wire transfers for deposits, uh, Zoom meetings for client consultations. So definitely um, still available for anybody who really needs something at this time. I'd also like to say a big thank you to all the doctors and nurses and the healthcare workers working so tirelessly to look after all those that are not well um, at this time and as well as of course all the uh, essential food supply workers that keep our grocery shelves stocked. I know it's a tough time but stay safe, stay home. We will all get through this together and come out much better on the other side.